Hello, I'm Charlie and welcome to Authentic Mental Health, the channel that offers advice and friendly support within our like-minded community with videos on mental health, self-help and self-improvement. So if you're new here, make sure you're subscribed and you've turned the bell notification button on so you never miss a helpful video that could help you. Today's video is coming up right after this. Have you ever felt alone in a room full of people? Do you feel as if nobody truly understands you? Do you feel empty, lost, hopeless or worthless? Does your anxiety stop you from doing things you want to do in your life? Are you depressed and don't know who to turn to for help or guidance? Are you currently struggling with your mental health? You never have to feel alone again. We understand you. We feel exactly like you do and we are here to support you. Share your story, connect with like-minded people, learn more about mental illnesses and how you can improve your mental health. Together, we can make a difference and together, we can reduce the stigma. Welcome to Authentic Mental Health. It's normal that families fight and get upset with each other sometimes. But having toxic parents is so much more than just fighting or getting upset with each other occasionally. Your parents don't need to be physically abusive or narcissistic for them to be considered toxic. Your parents could have been there for you your whole life and provided you with everything you needed but still could have been toxic towards you. Having toxic parents and being mistreated or neglected can leave someone with long lasting psychological trauma. If you want to know more about toxic parents, toxic relationships, toxic friendships or anything to do with toxic people, this is a new authentic mental health playlist based on toxic people. So make sure you're subscribed so you never miss a video that could help you. With that being said, here are five signs you have toxic parents, part one. Number one, your parents are self-centered. Your parents may say that they love you, they care about you, and they do everything for you. But they always seem to put their own wants and needs above your own. Number two, your parents are unsympathetic. Your parents may hurt you by saying horrible or nasty things to you. They know they have hurt you and probably made you cry because of it. But they never, ever apologize to you for hurting you. And they never show you any empathy or remorse for doing so. Number three, your parents blame you. Your parents might have broken a glass in the kitchen, but for some reason, it's your fault. Toxic parents blame their children for everything that goes wrong in their lives and get angry or upset with things that aren't even your fault. Number four, they exploit you. Toxic parents only love their children so long as they can use them. They are only nice to their children when they want something from them. If and when they don't need anything from you anymore, they'll stop pretending and acting like they care about you. Number five, your parents are abusive. If your parents are abusive towards you in any way, shape or form, be it emotionally, verbally or physically, then they are toxic parents. If you can relate to any of these signs and you believe you have toxic parents, please remember and know it's not your fault. You are not to blame for their toxic behavior. Keeping a toxic parent in your life puts your mental health at constant risk and it could leave you with emotional scars that may never ever heal. It's important you recognize the signs of a toxic parent so you can protect yourself from any more emotional suffering. If you've been able to relate to this video, please give this video a like. If you're new here, make sure you're subscribed to Authentic Mental Health so you never miss a video that could help you. Our social media links are in the description box down below. Take care guys and girls and I'll see you all again in another video.